In this video, we are going to explore a toolkit of strategies designed for effectiveness and efficiency by Pro Sport Development. Join us as we unlock the potential of sports and physical activities as catalysts for the inculcation of 21st century skills. This video serves as a roadmap to empower, inspire and shape the leaders of tomorrow. This is the last video of the series, aiming to provide step-by-step -step practical demonstrations of assessment for effective communication, curated tools developed by Pro Sport Development. Always remember that facilitators need to be good communicators, as communication plays a big role in facilitation. It helps in facilitators should leverage appropriate communication techniques to give important information to the participants, making the environment conducive for young individuals to learn and build different skills. Next is give instructions to a group. For a great learning experience, it's important to employ diverse communication techniques when explaining activities to young individuals. Ensure your instructions are clear and concise, allowing everyone to understand the session smoothly and achieve their learning goals. It is utmost important to provide necessary feedback. With proficient communication skills, Facilitators can offer effective and constructive feedback to participants, encouraging them to reflect on their performance, strengths and areas for improvement. Active listening is also a crucial component of communication, enabling facilitators to provide feedback and receive it from participants. This two-way communication is highly advantageous as it allows facilitators to address the specific needs of participants and further enhance their facilitation skills. It is important to maintain constant and effective communication with other stakeholders in the schooling system, including fellow teachers, the school administration and the parents of participants. Such communication is vital to ensure a shared understanding and strong support for the participation of young individuals in the activities. Additionally, communicating the values, benefits and proposed impact associated with regular participation in the devised intervention is essential. While understanding the importance of communication skills for being an adept facilitator, it is helpful for facilitators to conduct regular self-assessments to identify strengths and weaknesses in their communication. This periodic self-assessment enables facilitators to identify areas for improvement and actively work towards addressing them. It is also beneficial for facilitators to leverage these findings to share and exchange knowledge and best practices with other facilitators. Facilitators would find it helpful to fill out this self-assessment tool, using it to assess their communication skills as a reflection exercise. Each A entry will receive one point. Each B entry will receive two points and each C entry will receive three points. Sum the scores from each column to calculate the total score. Find your total score within the ranges provided in the table here. The table provided here will assist you in receiving feedback. Effective communication forms the foundation for the successful facilitation of sessions, enabling the transfer of relevant skills and knowledge. We hope this introduction to the Effective Communication Assessment has shed light on its vital role in evaluating facilitators' communication skills. This tool is designed to enhance your communication skills and make your facilitation journey popular, productive and enjoyable.